Hey guys, it's Nella here. Today I've got an epic challenge in front of me. I've got a six pound spicy ramen with so many toppings. Like this thing literally has my whole kitchen in it. It is full of stuff. It is, it is nuts. I've got some roast pork which I made last night. I've got some green onions up in the front there. I've got some bean sprouts, which I love bean sprouts in ramen. It's just like a really nice, I think it's like a nice texture. Like it's good to have like a, like a little bit of crunch, you know, just because everything's so like noodly. Um, I've got some mushrooms right here. I've got some pickled ginger. I've got some uh, green and red chili, like coated um, preserved mustard stems, which I've had these in ramen before and it was really nice. So, and I just tasted one before and they were pretty tasty. So yeah, so I've got those, and then I've also got some jellyfish back here, and this is, um, I don't, think, I don't know if it's real jellyfish or if it's like fake, but it's really good, I eat it a lot, I like it. Uh, this one is the sesame oil version. And then I've also got some eggs here, which I, I like um, marinated in like soy and Chinese black vinegar. They're very good, very tasty. Uh, and then I've also got some dried seaweed around the back here. But yeah, so that's everything I've got in there. In the broth, I've got two different types of uh, like pre-made ramen broths. I got one spicy one and one just original one. And each one has like two servings. So this is four servings plus all the other stuff in it. Um, and they're really good. I've had them before. And honestly, like it's up there. I'd say if you gave me a bowl of that and like a bowl of like an Auckland ramen place, I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. It's that good. But it's not as good as Japan, I'll admit that. It's, it's definitely not as good as like real ramen in Japan. But just like the places in Auckland, it's pretty close. It's pretty up there. So yeah, it's really tasty. So I've got that in there. And I've also got this amazing black garlic stuff, which I recently discovered. It's like a Korean product. It's really, really good. It's just absolutely amazing. So I put five of those in because it's delicious. I also put this in my meatballs. Not the spicy ones I ate on my challenge, but like ones I make at home and it's really really good in meatballs it's good in everything I've been putting it in everything it's really really nice so I'm obsessed I'm always obsessed with garlic but like black garlic it's like a new type of garlic for me to you know be obsessed with so yeah so I've got this giant bowl here it is it's very hot it's like scorching hot I'm like sweating and this bowl is boiling hot as well so it's gonna be a challenge in itself just eating a really hot bowl of ramen but yeah I'm gonna time myself see how quickly I can eat this I'm so excited because I absolutely love ramen like oh I love it so much I don't eat it enough I reckon because it's so tasty it's just it's difficult to make yourself because if you had to like make the broth yourself it takes like days but yeah so these packets are pretty good like I rate them highly and but then I'm not a very fussy person so I don't know how uh, how, how good my, my high rating is but they're tasty to me and I like them so that's all that matters um, and yeah so I'm just gonna tuck into it and see how quickly I can eat it so yeah I hope you guys enjoy the video
All right, three, two, one, and go. All right, firstly, I'm gonna try on my eggs because I'm excited about this. Oh, that was good. Okay. Let's get some of the noodles happening. These are really, really good. It's very hot as well, just like, whew. And you can definitely taste the spice as well. Mmm. It's very good though. Okay, try some mushrooms. I love those mushrooms, they are so good. Some of that pickled ginger. Oh yeah, that is good. Eat nothing mushroom, why not? Right, look at some bean sprouts. Ooh. Oh, they're like, the spiciness definitely like absorbed into the mushrooms. Ooh, okay. Mmm. God, I love bean sprouts. Okay. A little bit of the... Ooh, they all went under. Mmm. Nice fresh green onion. <coughs> oh, It is quite spicy. I wasn't expecting it to be like that much of a kick to it. Glad I didn't use two of the spicy ramens and only one. This is the mustard stem. Mmm. That is very good. Okay, some jellyfish. Mmm. Ooh. Ooh. It was very salty because I just dumped like the um the can plates with packets of seasoning and and oil, uh, sesame oil, and I just <laughs> dumped it on top. The packet of like seasoning was very s salty, but very tasty, nonetheless. Okay, I have a bit of pork. I'm gonna go for one that's underneath. Quite a lot of, I don't know where it's all gone, it's like all down somewhere. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do this one. <laughs> it's buried, I'll get to it eventually. Mmm. Very tasty pork. I'm gonna bite my face. Don't want to get too messy. Okay. Big bit of noodles. The noodles <coughs> are really good quality. I really like these noodles. Ooh, more mushrooms. Very tasty. I love these kind of mushrooms. I haven't had a piece of seaweed yet. It's not it's not crunchy anymore. But it's good. Very good. Four minutes, 30 time wise. <laughs> made, a, made a little bit of a dent. It's only gone down. Ooh, 
temperature wise and spice I mean it's nothing compared to like the spicy challenge I've been doing with all like the hella hot Korean nuclear fire sauce but still got a little bit of a kick to it mm. Another piece of pork. Oh, very like out of practice with chopsticks because obviously, like we've been locked down for a long time. I haven't been out to like a Japanese restaurant or any restaurant where I've been required to use chopsticks, so my skills aren't aren't very good at the moment. Ah, as you can see, but I try my best. And that's all that matters. Oh, there's so many noodles in this. Oh. Ooh. Oh, this would be like a really nice challenge if it was like really cold. Okay. What am I going for? Six minutes thirty, I reckon. I think just under 15, I'd be really happy. I was gonna say 10, that was like got four minutes in the whole time. Mm. Ooh. Ooh, I'm gonna have a little, little drink of Coke actually. My trusty Coke and sugar vanilla. Oh, that cooled me down. Oh, that's nice and cold. Okay. Sweating a little bit less now. I would open the door, but then you guys would have just heard traffic because I live in the middle of town. It's very noisy. Okay. Eight minutes. I reckon once I get all the noodles, like drinking the broth isn't going to be too difficult. Oh, there are a lot of noodles. I've got a little spoon here and a little fork just in case. I didn't quite back myself with the chopstick, but we're going, we're going all right. We're going all right for now. Oh, a little egg in there, a little egg underneath. A little hiding egg. Mmm. It's amazing how like strong that black garlic stuff is, but it's really good. If you know me, you know I love garlic. <sighs> oh, a little bit of meat. I knew it, I knew I'd put a lot more meat in there. There's two bits of meat here. Grab the first one. Oh, oh my my nose is running. Excuse me. Oh, okay. Bit of meat. Mm. Oh, got a little egg yolk. Oh, that was not here. Is little egg yolk. Oh, no, I've lost him. I'll come back for him later. Mm. 
Pardon. He's a slippery little fella. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> there is a big egg though. Oh god, it is hot. Well, there's the meat. Wait, and then it's 30. I can do this in 15. I believe. See, we got like wrap around the chopstick. Woo! Okay. I can soon we can start start the broth. Okay. Have a little drink coat before we do that. A little bit of, a bit of foam came up there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh God, I need a fan. Oh, okay. 11 minutes 30. Let's go. Okay. Oh, that is so good. But very spicy. Mm. I'm proud of myself. I didn't use the spoon and the fork at all. I mean, just wants to like enjoy it because <laughs> it tastes so good. Hmm. Well, a bit too clean. So saved it. It was splashed a little bit actually. Uh. 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 Pardon me. Okay, back to it. Uh, one more. <laughs> now back to it. Not much left. We can do it. Being very full. Too much stuff in it now, I need to actually do that. Oh, the bowl's very heavy. Very difficult. Okay. Mm. 
I don't want to use a spoon. It would make it so much easier. More left in the bottom. That would be so much easier with a spoon. That was intense. I'm pretty happy with my time though. 16 minutes and 32 seconds, which is pretty good. I reckon I could have shaved about a minute if I used the spoon. Just because the stuff on the bottom was really, really difficult to just like get out with the chopsticks. But yeah, and the bowl's really heavy. As you guys saw when I was weighing it, it's like it's a four pound bowl. Because this bowl with the like, noodles, noodles in it was like 10 pounds. So yeah, four pound bowl, huge. Um, <clears throat> oh, it is, the spice is like kicking in a bit more now as well. Nowhere near as bad as like <laughs> the nuclear fire sauce, but it is like, it is hot. Oh, I, and I'm sweating like, oh, I'm sweating like crazy. But yeah, pretty happy with that. 16 minutes, 32, massive six pound spicy bowl of ramen, which I am, I'm very full now. I need to lie down. Luckily, I don't have to run and grab the milk or like the ice cream. I like this, you know. I have a few more sips of coke and I'll be good. Oh, that's so nice. <coughs> okay. Whew. Oh yeah, that's good, being cooled down. Oh, I might have an ice shower actually, like a really cold shower, that would be nice. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Final time was 16 minutes and 32 seconds. Uh, remember, if you guys haven't already, you can grab my merch. There'll be a link down below in the description. I really appreciate everyone who's already bought it. Uh, if you guys do buy it, you'll get a specialized little video sent to you as like a thank you as well. Um, and yeah, remember to like the video and comment because all of that helps me. Share it if you want to. Subscribe if you haven't already. All of that helps me get up in the algorithm. So yeah, I really appreciate you guys. My videos have been absolutely popping off lately and it's all because of you guys. So yeah, huge thank you. I love you all and I'll see you guys next time. Definitely feel a little bit pregnant. Whew. <sighs>